This program is intended for mature audiences and may contain some material that is not suitable for everyone, including violence, coarse language, and unfiltered opinions. We do not endorse the views of those we report on. in the morning talking yeah. about some interesting stuff well and it's it's a lot better than the uh, morning coffee bullshit but we'll get into that later yeah i the reason i had to stop doing reviews of that live is because he was just intentionally putting in so much medical misinformation in there that it was getting to be seriously difficult to actually review it while oh God, youtube yeah. wasn't crawling up my ass about it it's yeah like, <laughs> uh good morning to everybody who might be chilling here uh, what's up, Jay Schroeder? I see. I still need to watch you on stream. You should check it out. It was a fan yeah. fantastic time, and they there's always timestamps there. There's so. a, yeah, I make sure that there's timestamps. You're even more uh <clears throat> dedicated to that shit than me. Sometimes it takes me a while, although I've been good about uh, it. Uh, with the four hour one, that took me two and a half hours to get out. Seriously? Uh, yeah, there was a all lot right. to go through. You're doing it all wrong. I know. I'm just kidding. Uh. <laughs> You know, I'm I, I'm just fucking around. That I was know, long I know, long I know, you're, I know you're pulling my leg. I know. It takes a while, but um, all right. Mm -hmm. So there, there's a couple things I want to talk about today. We've got a bit of a fucking update on Von Helton. We've got an update on Shani and Jason. I know this is super fucking early in the morning, so there might be some people who make it here live. There might be some people who don't. I trust that that if people don't make it here live, then they'll check it out in the fucking replay. I will have timestamps up almost immediately by the time we get this shit done with. Yeah. Nice to see you rape your Charizard. I I bought <laughs> rock from from Rev. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, <laughs> I don't know the implication. I, I know what the implications of that are. Let's let's be honest here. Um, all right, so let's let's just get into it. I only have a couple things for us to look at. Um, there's about 14 minutes worth of content here. First, we're gonna get into the whole Jason and and G Man thing. Apparently, Shani actually speaks up and gives her two cents too for the first oh time boy. regarding this issue. So, so yeah, let's get into this shit. This is um something I really wanted to go over recently. Mm -hmm. but we didn't have the chance because I, apparently this dropped like shortly after we did our show last night. Mm. So yeah, that, that entire time where I thought there was like no, no update at all on the whole situation immediately after we ended our show, um, we found some interesting fucking shit to take a look at. So let's take a look at this official response that, that Jason has towards G man for the stalkerish behavior that he was engaging in. It mm -hmm. was really some fucked up shit that G man said he was going to do. Yeah. Yeah. You don't, you don't, is you don't announce doing a bit of a fucking pass through and oh yeah i'm going to take pictures of the new car like, even if you're going to try and engage in that weird fucking vigilante justice which i don't condone or, or agree with personally it's it's, it's stupid, stupid to go out and say it live on the internet yeah. like that like you know what i mean even Should from it... even even removing the moral point of view from this like that that's not a good thing to do it is so fucking stupid to go on the internet and just directly say oh yeah i'm going to engage in this stalkerish behavior towards yeah sometime of around 11:30 or really early in the morning yeah yeah, it yeah real but, fucking smart. There. I don't know if you noticed, but like at some point he said really early in the morning. Then he was like, "Yeah, about at 11 p.m." Does G Man not know the difference between p.m. and a.m.? Because I uh, would not, I would not even call 11 a.m. early in the morning. <laughs> like, well, I, I mean, he doesn't know lines on the ground from a pedestrian crossing, which is fair. why he gets hit by cars. What's up, Rizla? 14 minutes—that's six hours for Carrie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look, sometimes when, especially when you have big panels, I know it takes us a while to get through content. I don't think we're that fucking bad, so I'm pretty proud of how efficiently we can get through content when we put our minds to it. 
let's exactly. just take a look at this shit, yeah. all right? Let's just get into it. I'm sure we'll have a lot to say. There's only eight minutes here, but it's going to be a long eight minutes. So let's take a look. <laughs> Amazing. Hi, guys. What's up? I am not going to wait for people to come in. I just want a statement to be made. Okay, official, because this is, as you see, it's the real Rev and Shanny channel. So when you want to hear actual statements. This looks from like graveyard flowers to me, but <laughs> the same way yeah. everybody else consumes your content. Yeah. By the way, drop a like there. Much deserved. From, from us. Because we happen to be two people that have like 50 million search people searching 50 million on TikTok. So if you want to, is he trying to pull uh, out like an actual statistic by saying that shit? Because that doesn't sound right. That's that's a number he pulled out of his ass. I know that the Zoomers there ain't no recently 50 did. Million people. I know recently there were some Zoomers who figured out about the Shanny and Jason thing. That's why I was kind of worried about like this becoming too main. Like I'm not usually concerned about that, but. I'm really concerned about like impressionable younger people finding these two idiots, not knowing how bad they are and sending them money. Cause that's the mm. type of people that they capitalize off the most is people who don't know better about them. Cause yeah, I could see even myself like looking at Shani and Jason for like the first time and being like, damn, these two must really fucking have it rough. And then you really find out all the terrible things that they've done. It's like, Oh, okay. They, they deserve every fucking thing that they've had tossed their way and more, which mm. isn't that surprising. There's a lot of people like that online, but. They're a particularly egregious case. I know the deal you come here. WPW? I don't know. Uh, Google photographs people's houses all the time. What's the big deal? It's just the intention behind what G-Man's trying to do and the fact that he's purely trying to do it for the sake of getting clout out of people like Carrie is just very strange, especially when this is a group of people that he was defending for a very long fucking time. It just seems like he's trying to basically use the situation to his advantage to try and grift and capitalize off it. And at the end of the day, that's what fucking bothers me. Uh, <laughs> you can have a different conversation about the whole vigilante justice thing. It's still not something I personally engage in, but I suppose there's an argument to be had. But yeah, the reason why it pisses me off and a lot of other people is simply because it's G-Man doing it. And we all know that he's just doing it for not even positive reasons he's not even trying to like yeah, bring anyone to fucking justice or anything he's, he's just, just trying as bad to grandstand. as these people yeah he's, he's trying, trying to grandstand, to grandstand even he's trying to virtue signal that type of shit yeah. yeah yeah um i never want i never want to photo someone's house yeah i mean th that's who fucking knows what g-man's trying to do with this fucking information honestly he could be trying to fucking borrow it off to fucking people on the internet for all we fucking know i wouldn't be surprised if that's what g-man was trying to do i don't know what that is sorry Hi, Gucci trolls. I want this stated. Everything, and I'll include Shani in this. Oh, no. Yeah, God bless you, Neocat Goddess. You're kind, okay? Can you finish a fucking thought Hi, one second, Jason? Like, What's Jesus up? Christ. Sorry, I went to go fucking pause the video, and I brought up someone's comment. I was not referring to you. <laughs> um, Jason cannot fucking articulate himself out of a fucking paper bag. He's, I he's just want to say this. stumbling jerk dick. He really is. And he's lower than a leprechaun's nutsack. I know that wasn't related to anything that we're saying, but I just want to throw yeah. that in there. Okay, and make it clear that the reason that you yeah, I'm live now. Hi. The reason that I did everything I did with Mr. Gary Lamont Moore, also known as G Man on YouTube. The reason that he goes out of his way to use his full name constantly, like, how do I feel bad? How can I possibly feel bad for either one of these parties when they do every opportunity that they can to be petty towards each other and just in general fucking piece of shit? You know what I mean? Like, I really don't want stalking to engage. I, I mean, I don't I don't want anyone to engage in stalking towards any anyone, no matter how reprehensibly fucking disgusting they are, obviously, because, you know, it's, it's, yeah. it's against the law. It's against the law for a goddamn reason. There should be these basic standards that we all adhere to, you know, to treat other people. But at the end of the fucking day, people like this really make me fucking question my morality, especially when it's people like G-Man and Shani and Jason going at each other. It's just like, how the fuck am I supposed to have an opinion on this other than I hope you all fucking face the worst of consequences? It's, I hope G-Man gets hit by a cop car. I hope Shani and, you know, goes to a fucking early grave. Fuck these two. Genuinely. It, it, it's, it's the great steer tussle. <laughs> Stop. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> first we had the cattle battle but then there's brand cow corral yeah. how many more fucking cattle themed fucking fights are we going to come up with on this show that we did any know. of the shit we did 
was in the name of Jesus Christ. I want this known. It wasn't for me getting some kind of, oh, I gave a house to a black man. What's up, Ling and things? What's up, Andre? Y- y'all deserve peace. Thank you, Andre. God, God bless you. I, we, I'm on say I, we, because she's my, Shani's my wife. Will you just fucking get to it, you piece of crap? We've been watching this for two fucking, minutes and you haven't said anything. Fucking Fuck. meandering brainlessly through the fucking word salad. Just if anything get to I the thought fucking this- point. Jason. If anything, I thought this would be interesting and start off with a bunch of e-begging because this is like a rare example of something actually happening to them, which I would consider to be fucking shitty and not justified. You know what I mean? Because I don't mm-hmm. I don't condone stalking behavior when it comes to anybody. And that's exactly what fucking G-Man was doing here. Mm-hmm. But he can't even fucking capitalize on this shit right. He's just going around fucking constantly flipping and flopping on what he's fucking saying. Jeez. He's squishing his oh, that I <laughs> No more flipping and flopping. Yeah, <laughs> jointly. Always did. As of March 7th of 2018, she owned half of everything I got. All right? God bless you, Andre. Are you proud about it or something? Like, he was exactly like this before. I don't know if he was exactly like this. I have seen videos uh, of him before he got with Shani and all that. So he wasn't not exactly like this. But sure, was he still a massive piece of shit? I can agree with that. I agree with that much. But he was not like this, I don't think. He already were gonna say something. Oh, uh, I, 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 I had a moment of doubt about that, but then I kind of went through kind of the, the memory a little bit. It was like, uh, maybe, but not to this fucking extent where he just he spiders out really weirdly, like with the fucking um, yeah, he has no cognitive conspiracy theory shit. He has like, no cognitive oh consistency with it when it when it comes to like he can't even finish a thought properly. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I butter. Do that. I want butter. <laughs> <laughs> that, by the way, that's our new that's our new stinger. <laughs> Get yourself familiar with it. It's gonna be way over fucking used, I'm sure. Oh yeah. yeah. In no time. And no fucking time it's flat. Peanut butter time. Peanut butter. We peanut heard butter. that a brother. This is this is what you have. Hey, what's up, Michelle? Okay. Oh my god, stop greeting people in the fucking chat already. Jesus Christ. I I get that out at the start for a reason. You know what I mean? If you constantly do it, then you're going to break up the flow of what you're saying. I get, Look, it's nice to greet people, but holy shit. <laughs> Thank you. That's flattering. Okay. <laughs> we viewed that man as a brother. We loved him greatly. Correct me if I'm wrong. Weren't you uh, losing the house anyway? No, absolutely not. I had plenty of money. To pay it off. Yeah, until fucking Shani guzzled it all down. Uh, just to bring the things you wanted. No. <laughs> UTI'd it, it away. No. <laughs> Told him there's no reason to contact me. I wanted no contact. You, th- Thank you for bringing that up. Uh, 86. I'll call you 86. I can keep my... Anna. Uh, I... Anna, I had a terrible thought. I had a terrible oh, no. thought. They didn't just go into the red. They went into the gray. They went into the gray. I should have known you were going to go there. You yeah, just, like, I know. Fuck went back in 20. I mean, I believe you. If you wanted to like, yeah. send me a particular clip of you, like, you know, showing how little of a difference it is, I would definitely fucking take a look at it. Because I'm always willing to see older, you know, older footage of these guys and compare and contrast. So, yeah, if you have a clip <clears> of that, I'd love to yeah. fucking see it. I'm sure it's on one of these channels or something like that. I told him, put it on the front porch. You get your buddy. Load up the truck, car, whatever he got, because he's got a friend that's got a car. Load it up with the stuff I mentioned, and we're good, man. Okay, go with God. Bless you. It was just a way to show me that you appreciated the fact that I sold you a house for a dollar. Katana, what's up? Maybe if you wanted something in return, then you should have asked for more than a goddamn dollar. Maybe you could have asked for like yeah. two dollars or something, Jason. Yeah, <laughs> you know you what I mean? Even, you could even even gotten the wildly rich amount of two dollars fifty cents. Yeah, you could have gotten a buck fifty. Holy bro. shit! Yeah, just keeping it at a buck fifty. <laughs> just keeping it at a buck fifty. No, that's not even that much more than he paid for a house. That's fucking hilarious. Yeah. Like Jason didn't even get a fucking full pack of cigarettes out of it. That's fucking insane. <laughs> shit. 
I sold you a house for a fucking dollar, G man. Is that supposed to make you look any better than you do? Because it doesn't. It makes you look worse, actually. And you sold it for $160,000. Okay. I am not a fucking, oh, gimme, gimme, gimme person. What's up, Chubbyusa? What's up, Lynn? What's, uh, G-Man is a creeper. What? I have to agree. Okay? That's why I call I don't disagree with that. That's for fucking sure. G-Man has been creepy yeah. as hell recently, especially with all the weird shit that he's been saying. Like, even taking away his aggression from yeah, Jason yeah, and Shannon, yeah, he's been yeah. saying weird shit about Carrie constantly, like how he th how he thinks she's hot and all that shit, constantly comparing and contrasting her with other women on YouTube and being like, oh, yeah, Carrie's so much hotter than Jules. Carrie's so much hotter than Shanny. He keeps saying this fucking shit. I've noticed it. He has this weird fucking crush on Carrie, and he keeps fucking sipping for her. Yeah. I don't get it, and I don't see the fucking appeal. Um, A stream at this hour is a surprise, <laughs> to be sure, but a welcome one. Yeah, I mean, hey, I felt like this needed to be put out there. We need to give an update, since this is something that a very close person to me who wishes to remain anonymous actually spurred on, so... I felt the need to actually address this as soon as it came up. So uh, there's not a ton of people here right now. Drop a like if you end up liking this shit. And thanks for just chilling here in the morning. I really do appreciate it. But let's continue. All the cops. Look, I got a message yesterday from someone named uh, Devin LaRoe. And he said. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> that was not the person's name, Jason, but okay. Jason, Jason. <laughs> Jason, that was not the person's name, but okay. Let's continue. Dude, I just want to give you a heads up that this guy's planning on coming to your house and doing something. He wants to find out about my new fancy car. My ride, whatever I may have right now, is nobody's business but my own. I do agree with that. G-Man needs to keep his fucking yeah. nose out of their business. Especially considering, like, look, they're always being shitheads. But it's not like, this is not the time where they had the fucking kids there. You cannot justify any and all actions against these fucking people at this yeah. point. Yeah, G-Man should have followed The Rock's fucking uh, catchphrase. Know your role and shut your mouth. Yep. Just sit on that fucking fence, Jason. Just sit on that fucking fence. And honestly, I don't want anybody knowing what I drive because I'm going to be targeted because it's happened before. People will t take the air out of my tires. Carrie's cute. I mean, I've never, I'm going to be honest with you. I've never seen fucking Carrie before. Yeah, I, but, yeah, but, you know, I don't know about that. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I can't speak to that. I won't <laughs> insult someone's appearance, but I've never heard a good thing about Carrie, so. They'll do some weird shit. I've had vandalism on the car already. And I think it was G-Man. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, you who, be who believes that? Do you believe that, Hyun? I want your... I, not for a fucking second, no. Honestly, with all the... Like, I, it's hard to believe it, right? Because it is coming out of Jason's mouth. But if anyone else said this, I would actually believe it. You know what I mean? Because I could believe that G-Man would do that shit. I could believe that he'd vandalize their fucking car. He talked about going to, to their fucking house. And mm -hmm. snapping pictures of their car for the fucking trolls to look at. Uh, he wanted like, a few pull rights because, you know, that car would be looking mighty thick. Maybe he'd get hit by it. <laughs> oh my god, stop. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> G-Man thought he was going to hit it from behind him, but it ended up turning out the other way around. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> so you want to go after a dolphin to track... What?! It's, it's 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 is that it's about cool. Carrie? Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah, Rizla Rizla's being um nice to see you, Moo. Fruity. There was a board. They they stuck it through one of the pieces on the on the the spoiler on the bottom. There was a board put through it. Oh, okay. okay. That's like a stalker, Gucci trolls. Yes. Wait, 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 wait. How? What was he? Let me take that. Back. Well, roll that back one more. The spoiler on the bottom. There was a board put through it. Oh, okay. okay. He's talking about his car. There was a board through put through the spoiler. <laughs> what the fuck? Why? What the, 
I would. Lo- Why didn't you take a picture of that? I, I honestly, I feel like if that actually happened, he would have talked about it earlier and provided some evidence. You know what I mean? Yeah. Who, who would not take a picture of that if it happened? Yeah, yeah. They would have been on here Mr. fucking begging for money and all that for replacement yeah. and all that shit. You know. M- Mr. Unite says one of the pieces of the spoiler on the bottom. He doesn't know what the fuck a spoiler is. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't know shit about cars either, so. I mean, I, I know what a, I know what a spoiler is. Yeah, I think we both know enough about cars to know that that's bullshit. Yeah, yeah, that's like a stalker, Gucci trolls. Yes, <laughs> you seem very forceful now. I like it. I have to be though. I have to be. I don't want to be. Honest question: Why do you keep bringing up a man if you want him to leave you alone? This is to be have things on record. I'm not going to have things out there. Because I see comments. Get yourself a cheap cam and put outside. Yeah, I agree with that. He should. I'm looking forward. To... I'm looking forward to Mango's stream because I know that she's going to go over this. It's going to be amazing. I'm looking forward to Mango's stream when um when Jason talks about the person who tipped him off. <laughs> That'll be a fun oh. reaction. Oh yeah, yeah, that will. <laughs> Can mm-hmm. you do whatever belongings are you mm-hmm. in the house? Thank you. My gosh, thank you, Michelle. That's all I ask. G-Man's a POS. Katana, I'm going to have to say, yeah. <laughs> why was he, why did he say it like that, though? Like, why did he feel the need to say it like that? And stop your vibes, absolutely. Slightest. Yeah, I don't know either. Uh, yeah. Carry demonetized channel. I still love that. He admitted he was going to creep around the house and record a video. Did Carrie get demonetized? Is that actually true? I didn't hear about that. Maybe oh, someone in the audience so can answer. Creepy. He was going to creep around the house. Oh, that fucking, that barracuda's finally talking up. That Let's Minnesota barracuda. That Minnesota barracuda is finally fucking speaking up finally on the Finally chiming in, finally yeah. quailing. <laughs> I'm, I'm. I used to not be able to, like, convey that noise, and now I can do it. <laughs> I feel yeah. weird about that. You're oh, acclimating. So I'm acclimating to the Yeah, audience. you're acclimating. He was going to creep around the house and make a video. That is stalker behavior and get arrested. You can't pull that shit in this place. There's no black people here. I'm <gasps> What? what? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. Hold the phone. This is not Domino's. Excuse Whoa, me, Jason. Wait a minute. All right. I'm really looking forward to Mango seeing this video. Oh now. my god. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, everyone. Holy um, I- I'm sorry, holy hopping horse shit. Holy hopping ho- ho- horse shit. Holy hopping horse shit. <laughs> that <laughs> is there's no black people around here. Like, what the fuck does that have to do with the price of rice in China? What does that have to do with anything? <laughs> like... You can't pull that shit in this place. There's no black people here. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> oh, God. It kills oh, me that G-Man me. doesn't realize Shandy's the opposite of a barracuda, a slim, fast, fierce predator. Hey, but when she, she when she's angry, she moves fast. She that's what she yeah, turns into a yeah. barracuda form. Yeah. Uh, I tried to explain it to him a few times, but the idiot can't cop. Oh my god! When we were making when me and Heon were making keeping it a buck fifty jokes in his fucking chat, he didn't even understand that. Yeah. He didn't even get his own fucking joke. He was like he, keeping he, it a keeping dollar. It 50. A dollar- 50 cents what he said it in the whitest way possible i was i did not know that a black person could act so caucasian i really didn't the, know that the the caucasity <laughs> you know what that reminds me of uh man this is one of my best jokes perhaps on the entire that i ever made on the internet and this really fucking sent old pimp monk into a fucking uh laughter when i when i said it to him this is a long time ago i said this now mm-hmm. but uh, when he was beefing with g-man a few years ago not even a few years ago it was probably like five years ago now jesus christ yeah, but when Pimp Monk was beefing with G Man, I called it the world's blackest white man versus the world's whitest black man. <laughs> <laughs> and I had never seen fucking Pimp Monk laugh quite that hard, <laughs> so <laughs> I was real fucking oh. proud of that one. Oh man, Shani is more like a bobbit worm instead of long. She is just what she she's she's like she's basically okay. If you've ever played Ocarina of Time, she's a like like. Yeah, she is. Yeah, she just eats everything and spits 
spits yeah. Link back yeah, out. Yeah, it right? seems like Jason's shield was consumed long ago, so he uh, has no more yeah. defenses. I'm yeah. not being racist. In Scranton, not being racist, <laughs> but you're racist. Oh, oh my, that's a great thing to say after a very bigoted statement. Mm. I ain't being racist. You know, saying that before or after something bigoted does not actually fucking yeah. defend you from yeah. what you just fucking said. That is, that fact, is not a credible defense. Yeah. yeah, it never has been and never will be. Plenty. But where I'm at, there's none. It's foreign. Okay? I, it's just the way it is here. You, you're kind of scared, New Rev. Well, it. I got to do what I got to do for my family. And he's, I think he's... Your family just consists of you and Shani at this point. Yeah. It's not like you're making a big sacrifice for, like, the kids or something like that. And we all know how he actually fucking cares, thinks about children. Mm -hmm. um, so, so yeah, it's not like he's doing something noble here. If he was e-begging for some noble purpose, I guess I'd understand. But, no, he's literally just doing it to get cigarettes. Not even to fucking feed himself or clothe himself or anything basic like that. Dude just wants some cigarettes. He wants a cheap to get high. That's what you, you know, that whole thing. That's basically what fucking Jason wants. That's all he fucking cares about is getting that next fucking fix. Yeah, G-Man's a fake Christian. I would never put that label, but his behavior is nuts. Yes, it would be the best to have proof of something happened. Yeah, it, that's why I preemptively called the cops. I think I made the right decision by preemptively calling the cops. I said who I was. They said, oh, yeah, your wife was pretty big on YouTube. And I was like, yup. <laughs> they Wait did not minute. say that. They did not fucking say that shit. Jason, no. you're, are you fucking with me, Jason? They did not say that shit. <laughs> they didn't say that. They did not. No, There's no didn't. fucking way. And The Rock means no way. This has been a great video. The start was dumb as shit. I almost gave up, but I'm glad that we continued watching. That's we soldiered on. That's how he's, uh, the cops said that. To, that's amazing. That's how Shanny's known. She was pretty big on YouTube. Yeah, that's correct. I'm not going to steal this person's joke. Someone in the comments said, uh, your wife was big on YouTube. Shanny is big everywhere. <laughs> 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 uh, thank you very much, HHM.1. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's fucking amazing. Thing is, he's not of Christ. If he's done you guys wrong, he judges people too. Yeah, he judges constantly. I you got some edibles? I left alone, and I'm tired of hearing these names over and over and over again. I know. World War Three starting, and we got this. I know, right? World War people III have been saying that for 50 fucking years, you goddamn oh piece God. of crap. I'll believe World War III has started when it actually fucking happens. I've been hearing that my entire goddamn life, and no one's had anything to fucking show for it ever since. So shut the fuck up about it already. Yeah, I, I get there's issues going on. I there, But you know what? There always has been fucking issues like this going on. I've yet to see what makes this shit any fucking different. But I suppose that we'll wait and fucking see. Uh, give him a break. He has to live with her. Uh, he's got to get those... Yeah, but... I don't think brownies are supposed to be gray, so. Yeah, I don't know about that. Yeah, really. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You absolutely did the right yeah, thing. I think can't I did. people get along? I we mean, hop on team. What a fucking team. empty platitude that just plopped out of her mouth like a turd in the punch bowl. Yeah, we were talking about G-Man virtue signaling, and now they're engaged in the exact same fucking behavior. They have nothing of substance, even though there's actual substantive th things to make fun of about G-Man to mock him for. He's literally engaging in stalkerish behavior, and they're barely fucking playing that shit up. They're talking about all the other fucking shit about G-Man that doesn't nearly matter as much. Yeah. Because they're petty and incompetent, it, but... It's it's inconsequential. <laughs> exactly. If they had two fucking brain cells to rub together, they'd be really harping on about G-Man actually doing something like this. But no, everything is just peripheral. Headline, World War Three begins. Shani is the biggest victim. Yeah, she's going to be the new fucking Franz Ferdinand. <laughs> Wait, that's uh, someone else. Anyway, what, whatever. You got you got the fucking idea. Yeah, Archduke. Franz yeah, yeah, Ferdinand. the Archduke. Yeah. Yeah. Archduke. <laughs> yeah, we're here for you, tough boy Jason, getting revenge. I don't need revenge. I want the guy to leave me the fuck alone. But I want it known that I did this. Everything we did was in the name of Jesus. I put this at the altar of Jesus Christ. I, I feel when you help someone in need, G Man was homeless at this time. Homeless. 
We heard that call and said, holy shit, we got a house in Pennsylvania. Go live in it. And he ended up getting it for a dollar. And that's how he treats us. I don't care. This is just decency. I just remove remove the Christian. Like, I agree that he shouldn't be fucking stalker stalking you. But if we're talking about who has actually provided who with more, G Man yeah. has done a whole lot more for you guys than you guys that's, have ever done for him. That's just because you were stupid, part. yeah. Just because you were stupid enough to sell a man a fucking house for one dollar. Which is something that you'd only fucking hear about in some Onion story or Saturday Night Live fucking skit that only fucking a boomer could think of. But no, it's actually goddamn real. It's sad to fucking see. Your life is literally so fucking unbelievable that I have a hard time convincing some people that the things that I'm saying about you guys are real sometimes. Unless they're familiar with you, of course. Then it's easy to fucking say. But me teaching someone about Shannon and Jason for the first time, they're not going to believe half the shit I'm saying because it doesn't sound believable end of it it's two people that literally provided a place for him to live forever if he wanted that's also he a really good point jay like the amount of work that g-man had to put into that fucking place to actually make it livable and sellable like he yeah. actually did put a ton of work like look was it worth one dollar when he got it no i'm sure it wasn't it's property it could have literally been fucking empty land and it would have been worth more than one dollar but still like g-man did at least put in the fucking effort to make that fucking sellable so that him acting like it was just this fucking gift that they gave him and he didn't have to put in any effort to fucking work on it. That wasn't that house about to be fucking condemned or some shit. It was close. It to was him, practically sure. condemned. Yeah. yeah, it was practically fucking condemned. And G-Man th turned things around. He's a piece of shit and a fucking stalker. But I'm not going to allow them to fucking put out the wrong criticisms of him. They're making the wrong fucking criticisms. When this man was literally fucking going around and engaging in stalkerish behavior, his intentions to do stalkerish behavior, this is the only shit that Jason can talk about. Maybe you need to start going off script from whatever fucking Shannon starts telling you because this is not the argument they be making, buddy. He chose to sell it. That's fine. It's his house. But the way that we've been treated, he's not a Christian. Peace and Maranatha. That's a fucking fallacy. Essentially, what we're what we've come to now is they're both engaging in this no true Scotsman shit, where G Man doesn't believe that they're real Christians. They don't believe that G Man's a real fucking Christian. Just based on the based on the concept that they don't like each other. Like you know what I mean? There's no substance ar argument for why they aren't. The only yeah. thing that G Man seems to ever say is like, "Oh, they've turned into communists," which is fucking funny, but not accurate. Yeah, not at all. Not fucking at all. Um. We have a Vaughn video that we can get to as well. Oh, Apparently, yeah. he, uh, he forgot to pay his internet bill, and it's... Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> his spectrum <laughs> bill has quadrupled. This is even more recent than what we just took a look at right now. Yeah. So thank you, Pats and the Pizza, for this as, as well. The last one was from Graveyard Flowers. I, I think I brought that up. But if not, you know, go check out Graveyard Flowers. Good shit over there. Only place you should be watching, Shandy and Jason. And the main reason why I say that is because you can actually pause and go backwards. So... <laughs> Thank you, Graveyard Flowers, for this insane innovation known as going backwards. You're right. But also, thank you for Nats and the Pizza for what we're about to watch right here. So let's see what Vaughn has to say. I believe this was um him having a conversation with... uh. Let me see. I think uh, th they were mentioned by name in the Trolls, Haters, and Naysayers. Yeah, I think this is... Is this a Cisco person? It was live. Yeah, I think this is this uh the, the Cisco guy. Oh, God. This guy's been like being really nice to Vaughn for no fucking reason. Some people might be, some people might not understand. Like, uh, when I have a conversation with Vaughn, I'm not going to be super fucking aggressive because it's our first conversation, but I am going to ask yeah. him interesting questions. You know, I'm yeah. not just going to fucking throw him like softball fucking questions constantly. I really do want to pick his brain and that's what it boils down to. But if you're just there to suck his dick all day and pretend to get on his good side, do something better with your time for once, but also you're not going to win any fucking favor sucking Vaughn di Vaughn's dick. Like, we, we've all seen what it looks like. It's not that impressive, so. <laughs> um, Goddamn. By the way, if you guys enjoy this, it's really early in the morning. I'm glad to have any of you guys here. Drop a like if you like this shit. It's much appreciated. I do want to get in the habit of doing this shit more often in the morning, so. So, thank you. Renters? Oh, my renters? They're doing yeah. great. My renters That's are good. awesome. Yeah, my renters are doing awesome, man. They're doing great. And uh, got rid of one set of renters and got another set of renters. So now I went from $100 a month to 425 a month. That does not sound accurate. Also, yeah, things were no. going so well. 
Why did you need a new set of renters already? This is one thing I'm going to ask him about when I have that interview with him coming up soon. I'm going to ask him about the fucking property. I think L Lusty gave me a great fucking couple of questions regarding that. I'm going to ask him about that, see what he has to say. It yeah, seems like I, something he's willing to talk about. So, Yeah, you may have to do a little investigation into Von Helton Estates. Now with asbestos. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, I can't help but think this dumb pervert is running up charges for porn sites. He's like the one person who would pay for porn. Let's be entirely honest. Um, yeah. I mean, he gave fucking Brittany Venti fucking $3,000 and didn't even get to see your fucking coochie. So, yeah, mm. he does seem like the type of person who would pay for that type of stuff on a regular basis. What's up, dude, brother? It's nice to see you. Have a good morning. So that's a big, big help right there. Uh, hopefully the agreement you made with your renters, you can kick them out if they become too vile or too abusive or something like that. No, these are good people, man. These are okay. all good people. All right. Yeah, these are all good people. I don't have to worry about a thing. It's nice to have someone check on you once in a while. Yeah, well, they they check on me. I, I he's not him. listening to a goddamn thing that this person's saying, is he? Like you can tell that he just doesn't give a fuck at all about what's being said to him. I hope that when we have our interview, that he's more fucking um on point than this. Because if I'm just talking to a wall the whole time, I I might end up thinking that I'm Jeff Holiday after all. Yeah, yeah. Do so. Yeah, just for health reasons and your yeah, age and stuff. For health like reasons, correct. For health reasons, yeah. They should check on you once a day. Yeah, it shouldn't hurt. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And there's hopefully, that. if well, ho hope nothing happens. Jesus Christ, his nose just keeps getting it. bigger and bigger <laughs> and bigger. Look at that fucking schnoz, people. Because obviously, I got a big honk of picture. George Washington up there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, take a look at the big honk and picture. Uh, also, oh. you replied to someone in the chat here. Uh, what's Moose says? Does he have ownership over the rental properties? I have no idea. Yeah, uh, I yeah, don't know offhand. It's unclear. Are you paying uh, him for the interview? No, he said he would have a conversation with me for free. Yeah, I mean, no, he didn't. Man. He didn't ask for any money or anything like that. No remuneration. Yeah, I, I mean, I did phrase it to him like I do want to, like, uh, work things out because I think he does have he genuinely does have a lot of misconceptions about this fucking show. So I wanted to clear things up to him. And he's been, like, surprisingly pleasant to me in DMs. Last time I showed you an email, I, he, he included a smiley face and everything. He seems like he's willing to be civil with me. I guess we'll see how it goes. If J-Dubs mm. is not there, then I'm willing to bet that me and Vaughn will actually have a pretty fucking decent conversation. Honestly. Yeah. It happens. Uh, we would find out too, me and John. Yeah, we find out. Spectrum has now literally quadrupled the uh, cost of my goods and services. So, is that why you're charging your renters an upcharge of fucking three hundred dollars or some shit? Uh, not only that, the reason why though that those bills are going up is because the benefit is ending and they're. Shifting everything back to the original pricing, so you get to pay that. Plus, you haven't paid your your own fucking bill in so many months, uh, gummy. So I'm gonna have to give them a, a phone call to find out what in the hell's going on. What's the goods and services down there? Or? Well, I, I I was paying fifty bucks a month for my mobile device, and I mm -hmm. thought that was high. But I just got a bill in in my email. Oh, for it's for your cell phone. That's for $110. What did I do? Didn't you say it quadrupled? Yeah, Vaughn doesn't know how to math at let all. Let me take let me take that back real fast. He said it quadrupled, right? It, it says yeah, it it quadrupled, yes. Well, I, I I was paying 50 bucks a month for my mobile device. And I mm -hmm. thought that was high. But I just got a bill in in my email. Oh, for it's for your cell phone. That's for $110. That's not quadrupled. <laughs> Yeah, that's doubled. <laughs> that's doubled. Really, Vaughn? This explains how he doesn't fucking believe the, uh, you know, the actual fucking story when it comes to what went down in Europe back in the day. You know what I mean? That explains why he doesn't know how to do basic fucking math that would lead you to conclusions mm -hmm. that everybody should be able to be led to if you can do basic math. That is something I've, I'm very fucking taken aback by it, just how bad and incompetent that really oh is. Oh my god. Oh, just wait. Uh, just wait. He has executorships, so he can rent the estate's props, but he, but it shouldn't be, be to profit him. Okay, interesting. Inter Thank you yeah. for that info. Um, Some people think that this Cisco guy is some dude who was around back in the day called Avatar, who had brain damage from a car accident. Jesus Christ. 
Uh, Reds will think they, they sound similar. To, I, I have never heard about that. I if anyone never. can provide me like a clip of that, I'd love to take a look and like compare and contrast. But uh, but yeah, thanks for, for, for letting me know. That's really strange if so. But I suppose I'm not surprised if someone who associates and hangs around Von Health and is trying to like reform themselves and give themselves a new identity. That sounds just like the type of shit that someone who hangs out with Vaughn would do. I mean, look mm. how many times fucking Jay Chubbs has changed his name. Oh, my God. Yeah. Countless times. What? My damn cell phone for my mobile device. No, no, that doesn't sound right. You you hardly use the well, damn thing. Of course thing. that's not right. I hardly use the damn thing. So something is wrong. So I got, I'm going to call him Monday, bright and early. Do you have a landline? Huh? Do you have a landline? Yeah, I got a landline. Well, cancel your cell phone, Bill. You don't need it. I, well, the cell phone is convenient in the sense that um, I can um, uh, use uh, Cash App. Oh, yeah. I see. But it shouldn't cost you like $110 well, a no, month. Well, no, it's not. Yeah, but a mobile device shouldn't be running me no $110 a month. So I'm going to call Spectrum and say, hey, what you know? What the hell's going on here? I mean, no, I my... thought 50 bucks a month was bad, but now it's 110 What the Yeah, fuck? not fucking hey, quadruple, hey, you dumb piece of crap. Hey, hang, hang on. Spectrum doesn't doesn't cover phones that's that's an internet service provider not a phone carrier oh my god yeah you're right he's acting like it's fucking t-mobile oh my god shit. i didn't even yeah, catch yeah that. he called T he called teespring last time a teespring mobile <laughs> <laughs> yeah fuck they'll take their shirt um, off your back call them. it's got to be a computer glitch or something. And put you in the closet <laughs> yeah, it's so i'm gonna, I'm gonna call up and see if we can't figure out what the hell's going on because am i am i am my phone my internet and my cable have went through the roof too. Yep. It's now three hundred and some dollars. It's like, wait a minute, that that's not right either, because no, I think I only paid wrong. like one hundred and fifty for all three of them. Now I'm paying three hundred for all three of them. And it's like, what the? Even that is not quadruple. That's double. Yeah. How fucking stupid is he? I don't fucking know, but I don't even know why this Rube has a goddamn. You can't even do basic landline and, and cable. Yeah, that's true. This, this motherfucker doesn't watch days? TV. I, I know, like, usually people only have landlines these days if they're just part of some type of a package or some type of shit mm -hmm. like that. But who needs a fucking landline these days? The fuck? Something is wrong. I kind of want one. I'm going to call. You do? Fuck you. Yeah. I kind of want one just in yes. case something happens. Yeah, fuck you. Sort out the problem. Nah. And, and if they fuck you and fuck landlines, have you seen like the modern day like house phones? They look strange. It's like a strange. That's why I'm getting a goddamn Soviet phone. Shut up. A Soviet phone. All right. Enjoy your fucking communism talk. Insist that these <laughs> numbers are legitimate. Talk. Guys, seriously. Yeah, but let's say they insist on it. Then I'll just tell them, okay, great. Whip out the Gensu knives and just start. Mm -hmm. just... Don't whip out anything, Vaughn. We don't want to. Yeah. That. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Just keep that shit. Yeah. Keep away that shit from people. All right. Yeah. I ain't nope. paying no six hundred goddamn dollars a month. No, I'm not. That's the, rent, the renters that are renting this single wide. Do they uh, share your internet or do they? Free interwebs probably had some clause where it was tied in a rate, and once the freebie expired, that's true. Yeah, that's actually a good point. Yeah, a lot of the time they will give you like certain deals for up to a certain amount of time, like for the first year or so, it'll be less. Yeah, or some shit but, like that, and then it'll go but, up. Yeah, but the but the overall thing is that vaughn had the acp benefit and that's ending next month oh like, okay that's entirely. a good fucking point yeah. yeah yeah i didn't think about that either yeah that's a good point they buy their own they have their own they have their okay. own phone okay. their own internet their own cable that's in good. fact they just didn't get their phone installed the other day i was paying 50 oh my god frank saw my fucking peanut butter clip <laughs> oh boy i might have to upload that for the tgr brand so they can use it yeah bucks a month for my mobile device shouldn't even cost that much well no it shouldn't but i that's what i was paying but now it's doubled now i'm paying 110 a month so something has went horribly wrong somewhere so i gotta call them and find out what the problem was now my now, you could always bring in your phone into the uh, mobile shop and just show them that you're hardly using the damn thing who says anymore. mobile like that like, Right, Canadians. Now my, now my, no, fuck them. My, my cable, my <laughs> phone, and my internet. In some cases, literally. Internet, my regular phone, landline phone, and internet. Um, I was paying like 150 a month. Mm -hmm. Now I'm paying 250 a month. Yeah. And so you know, so my mobile device is doubled, and all my other shit is doubled under Spectrum. So I.
holy hopping horse shit. You've been played like a piddle. You've been played like a piddle. Vaughn, you've been played like a fucking fiddle, man. You Vaughn's fell. Been that, fiddled. You fell for that corporate bullshit. Yep. I need to call them Monday, bright and early Monday morning. I'm going to call them and say, "Hey, what what's up, man? <laughs> Something is wrong." Because I'm probably my... missed a payment. Yeah, he has missed several. That's a good. That's a good point. Like this has been a problem like multiple times now. Numerous payments have only been covered because of fucking J Dubs. Yep. That's why Vaughn and J Dubs have been like together like fucking glue recently. Because yeah, it's J Dubs has been doing a lot for Vaughn, honestly. I hate the guy, but he has been doing a lot for Vaughn. So Yeah, not not only that, it's that brown noser subsidy. <laughs> oh man, we went from gray to brown. What a uh, fucking morning stream this has been. Shit doubled, literally doubled overnight. It's like what the fuck? So I'm I'm hoping it's just a computer glitch. Yeah, it's we'll a little it weird. Fixed. And uh, we'll get it fixed and get everything back. Sounds like he's speaking to a social worker doing outreach to a confused elderly citizen. <laughs> That's like painfully accurate. Uh, so there are three things to inc for rent increase within Kentucky's private rental. Landlords must provide a minimum of 30 days written notice for rent increases or changes in lease terms for month to month agreements. So, yeah, for I mean, for numerous reasons, we already knew what Vaughn was saying sound like bullshit, but. Yeah, another reason why what he's saying sounds incredibly inconsistent with what the fucking law is here. Two, rent prices cannot be raised during a lease's term unless the contract allows for adjustments. And three, lease agreements containing adjustment clauses must still adhere to notice requirements. Yeah, do you think that Vaughn would honor any of those fucking requirements? But he took real estate law. Oh, yeah, it's free real estate, right? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. So cold. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully. Get everything back to so-called normal and see if we can't uh, get everything. There situated. is no normal with you. But yeah, I'm at 110 for my fucking mobile device. And that's, I heard pretty much my, that's pretty much how much my phone bill is. I got a brand new iPhone 14 Pro Max and that's pretty much 110 a month. Yeah, but you use your shit all the time though, right? Yeah, I use it all the time. Yeah, right? see, I, hardly, I, I hardly touch mine. That doesn't make a difference. Usually it's yeah, a you, flat rate. Yeah, you get assessed a flat rate whether or not you fucking use your device, dumbass. Also, I don't believe that Vaughn is not online all the time. Like, when he isn't at this fucking desk, he probably has that phone in his hand, smacking it around with his fucking gums. <laughs> Only thing I use mine for is Cash App. That's mm -hmm. it. All right. Yeah. And the Jesus. test determined that was lie. That was fucking bullshit. Of course it was. Mm-hmm. Um, we do have one other thing we can take a look at, don't we? Okay. Actually, there's a short Vaughn clip that this one's only two minutes. Fuck it. We'll take a look at this. Why the fuck not? We'll take a look at this, too. It's only like two minutes and 30 seconds, and then we'll take a look at the last thing. <laughs> Since we do have some people here, I do want to. Yeah. I do want to send them off with something good, you know? Yeah. Yeah. After this, after this. So how's your day been? My day has been. Um, um, I got rid of one <laughs> cash app and chatterbait. Yeah, that sounds accurate. And got a better renter. And this renter actually wants to pay money, so <laughs> it's always a good thing. I don't know what happened with the other renter. I don't know what you were just saying. Everything was great with your fucking renters. Oh, this this was this was three days ago. This was two days ago, yes. But like he when he was talking in that previous video, he said like everything's been great lately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He didn't allude to there being any issues with this. The problem was I think there was some kind of internal conflict, if you get my meaning. And so I didn't want to get was there a domestic violence situation? Did you let Dorn and Brett move in? Is oh that what God. happened? <laughs> oh, wow. Get anywhere. What's up, Kyle? Nice to fucking see you. They died oh. from the slugs. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> they slugged it out. Yeah. We're involved in that shit. And yeah, so you gotta stay out of that. You don't want I just thought of a great fuck. Oh, my God. <laughs> you, you suppose when Vaughn was a kid back when he was Karate Kyle, that one of his dad's nicknames for him was Slugger? Probably, probably. <laughs> Can you I'm here a little now? slugger. Yeah, I'm that's right. Slugger. <laughs> yeah, you get back in your karate <laughs> classes now. You got to stay out of that shit. So, uh, but anyway, uh, these guys are taking over. They've signed the lease and they're going to start paying next month. And so it's going to be glorious. And um, right now we're trying to get the female part of the other renters. Oh, he is. She is being um, 
disagreeable on some things. So there's trouble in paradise is what you're saying. This is the thing you were saying literally fucking two days ago is inconsistent with what you just said yesterday. What a surprise, brother. Apparently, according to the new renters who are trying to get into the building and cannot because she has locked the deadbolt. Apparently, she had the key to the deadbolt. He had the key to the door lock and it's a mess. So the old renter that you kicked out won't let the new one in. Correct. But that's going to be handled. They're going to go talk to the guy, see if they can, see if he can get the key. Oh, from... my God. The police are going to show up on Vaughn's property. <laughs> I'm sure this will lead to shenanigans if this is actually happening. Wee -woo, wee -woo, wee -woo, wee -woo, wee -woo. From the female uh, so that they've got the key to the deadbolt. And if they've got if they can get the key to the deadbolt. Then they'll just go on ahead and go in as is, and you know. Go Imagine Vaughn being your landlord; he would be the goddamn shittiest one imaginable. And yeah, he would definitely use his fucking power to like hit on feet on like woman tenants and all that shit. Trying to cut that word out of my vocabulary. Trying to like you know hit on women tenants and all that shit. He will definitely try and do that shit. If this is actually happening, which I have, I suppose I have reason to believe that this is actually happening. Just not that the money is going where it should be, but he probably does have renters. Um. It's just absolutely fucking insane. I, I look forward to seeing where this ends up going. Because his stuff is already out. I don't know if her stuff is out. Uh, it doesn't really matter. Because, I mean, if she doesn't vacate, then I get the sheriff. And the sheriff makes her. I, just, makes I her just grab a pair of um, bolt cutters and just cut the thing right off. No, 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 no. Someone should do that with Vaughn's ball sack. <laughs> that that doesn't work with the fucking deadbolt, Jacobs. <laughs> yeah. Baloney tits over here doesn't know what the fucking deadbolt is. No, 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 no. We got to fucking keep the shit. You know, we got to keep everything. Yeah, um, I, you can't yeah, call, you I can't mean, well, the, the, everything's, you know, the locks and shit are all brand new. I don't want to destroy them. Everything, everything's uh, working, working out pretty good. Uh, everything will be uh, squared away here. Pretty, pretty yeah, everything will work out. Yeah, it sounds good. Well, I, my, 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 my crypto. I mean, his mouth was fucking full of goddamn food when he was saying that shit. Did you hear that? Like. Have some goddamn self-respect. Yeah, it keeps fucking crashing for some reason. I don't know. I started out with a dollar on each one. Now it's down to like five cents. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck's going on with that shit. Uh, well, you ain't not doing a dollar in any way, so... It, it was... just hates me, that's all. It just hates me. Wow, look, his internet's literally taking <laughs> yeah. a low, real time. <laughs> yeah, low frame rate Vaughn getting throttled. Oh, man. You've heard of eggs by the Vaughn? This is Vaughn Helton on the spectrum. Internet by the Vaughn. <laughs> yeah. Uh, frame rates by the phone. That's all. You're you just butt hurt. That's all. <laughs> uh, it's Clay County. Everyone is desperate there. Fair enough, Resla. Desperate renters, desperate slumlord, Papa Vaughn's. Oh my lord! Fuck okay. it, I, uh, fuck it. Let's check out another one. I'm kind of in the mood. All right, all right, all right. Plus, um, plus things have been uh, people have been hopping in here. It's nice to see it. 15 beautiful people watching right now. Yeah. Guys, it's early in the morning. Likes are sparser. They're harder to come by. So if you guys can help out, it's much appreciated. Uh, drop a like if you like this shit. My oh, winners are bad. Oh, my winners. Oh, <laughs> oh, God. No, oh, I'm the fucking... Right oh, that bit rate is really hitting low. Yep. <coughs> my renters are back. Let's see if they're going to... Imagine me trying to make a thumbnail with this shit. I hope this saga doesn't last too long. If, if their buddy is going to rent the other building. He's all nose. He's all fucking nose. Look at that frame. Just, yeah, it, his nose extends two <laughs> fucking frames in front of him. The only thing I can make out is his fucking nose. Like, goddamn. It, it's it's like uh, it's like Vaughn smeared Vaseline all over the lens and just went... Oh, eh. <laughs> uh, man. Wouldn't be the first time, though. Gonna rent. <laughs> Crafting. Got my lease signed, bro. We can't see uh -oh. shit, brother. We can't see fucking shit. We ha we have assistance. The Von Helton Estates. Von Helton Estates. I love it. It. He I printed know. everything in Impact. That's oh my god. <laughs> Might as well have fucking used Comic Sans. Yeah, or Papyrus. Von Helton Estates. Please that is it. fucking awesome, man. Yes, it is. That's extremely fucking awesome. Yes. And we did it fucking live, man. We're building Fallout mods, and we're getting the fucking leases signed. That's what I thought. Think it is. We're doing houses in real life and houses online. They should tell fucking Von Helton's uh, renters about the whole uh, 
you know, about his Fallout mods. I wonder if they'd be wanting to live in the same fucking area as him after that. And at the same damn time. I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's be honest, it's fucking Clay County. The majority of people probably think exactly the same as him. I like that. <laughs> I like that. Doing houses in real life and houses online. Is Impact free to use? I'm not sure. I assume it's one of those fucking open. Yeah, ones. yeah. It, Impact's pretty common. It's on most Windows yeah. devices. Yeah. I like that shit. They're all taking off. All my renters are leaving, but that's okay as long as they pay. <laughs> and you end up saying th like three fucking days after this that everything is just fine. You have a ton of renters and it's okay. You were literally talking in this video, which is not that fucking long before that you don't have check fucking shit. So which one is it? This See, this is the thing with Vaughn. He goes back and forth. He flip flops back and forth consistently between my life's perfect and I'm going to win. And my life's over, and I need your help. There is no in between. Von Helt is never just doing okay. He's either doing the best he's ever done in his life or the worst. And it's always a lie, either fucking way. And pay they shall. Look at that face. <laughs> look at that fucking face. It, that doesn't that doesn't look like a face. It looks like he's okay. If you've ever watched the X Files, he's like um the he's like the colonists. His <laughs> his face looks like it's been. Like, completely shut over. Look at that shit-eating grin. We can't oh even make God. out his fucking face. You know what I mean? Like, his mouth, I mean? Like, all I can see in his... Who is animated him? Out. Who the fuck I, animated him? They need to I be mean. fired. Yeah. They shall. It's going to be glorious. Yeah, I mean, they do need to be fired. Like, what is, what is <laughs> wow. this? Like, two frames per Look second? At that. Like... Look at that fucking frame smear. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. May is going to be payday, man. May is going to be payday. So they helped, they helped you move and everything? Everything's okay? Yeah, man, it's great. They helped move my shit over here, and I moved their shit over there, and everything's just ducky, man. Everything's just great. Yeah, awesome. Ducky? <laughs> ducky? Ducky? Du I've never heard that one Jesus before. Christ. Vaughn, you're in your 60s. Why are you talking like some fruitcake from the 30s? <laughs> God damn it, Anna. Oh my god. I knew I could get a cheap laugh out of that one. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh man. YouTube says they're going to put the trolls videos back up unless you show evidence that you're taking them to court. Oh, he's talking about Todd. Uh, he's talking yeah. about Todd, right? Yeah, yeah. Is he watching Unterhaven right now? <laughs> that, no, I get, I don't that know. could be possible because that's the only place where I think Todd is like put out an, an update other than like the THN server. I mean, no Vaughn's not in this. That. This was again. This was some days ago. Yeah, so. but like this, uh, that was around when the Todd shit was still pretty fucking new. Yeah, but Todd got dinged a few days beforehand. Yeah, but like, when did Todd come on Underhaven? Wednesday, right? That was the tenth, and this this is the eleventh. And th wait, this was said on the tenth. So yeah, yeah th there's a chance that this actually is fucking related. Maybe he's mm -hmm. watching Underhaven. I mean, he is going to be coming on soon. You know yeah. what I mean? What the fuck? Something. That's a bitch. But they can take our, our videos down with impunity. But if we try to take their videos down, then, then we've got... Yeah, because you fucking say all this insane shit that YouTube doesn't like. I don't agree with all of YouTube's policies, but the shit that you guys say, genuinely, I can understand why not, they don't not, want it on their platform. Not to mention, when you file a fucking DMCA and somebody files a counterclaim, like... Either you take them to fucking court or you don't. Yeah, and Todd was being transformative in his content. He was not just uploading or playing your content verbatim. You yeah. know what I mean? He was offering commentary. There it's not even like it's not even like points. Exactly. It's not even like an archive channel like Graveyard Flowers and Ads in the Pizza, who do great work, by the way. But yeah. you know, it, 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 it's a different type of thing where Todd is going in and you can't even fucking make an argument that it's not transformative. He's disagreeing with a lot of the shit that they have to say. He's offering his commentary in other ways. And not mm -hmm. only that, but Todd's streams are not entirely just talking about Vaughn. I know they're always called sniping Vaughn Helton, but you know Todd talks about other so, shit sometimes, too. Sometimes, sometimes they arrive late, and Todd plays Sudoku. Yeah, I mean, he he does his own fucking shit. It's transformative yeah. content, one hundred percent. Got to fucking show proof we're taking him to court. What a load of horse shit, YouTube! You fucking biased son of a bitches! You're biased towards your content creators, and you support the fucking trolls. You're evil, YouTube, and you need to be destroyed. Oh, I'm sorry, you don't understand fucking how YouTube works, dumbass. YouTube is evil and needs to be destroyed, but not for the reasons that Vaughn fucking thinks, that's for sure. 
Um, yeah. It's actually all for me. It's all the fucking misinformation that they allow to be promoted. The fact the people who are not that dissimilar from Von Helton, but still are able to make a massive fucking profit on this website anyway, because they have enough people watching them. Uh, you, you can probably think of quite a few people who are like mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. People who don't have people who don't deserve an audience, but have one anyway because of YouTube. And they're not that different from Vaughn. They're not that yep. different from Vaughn. The only difference is that they actually have respect. In the beam. So what are you over there doing? You making any mods? What am I doing? You making mods over there? What are you doing? Uh, no, no. I'm just checking my email. I was checking my email. Ain't that a fucked up email, man? That YouTube sent me a fucked up message, isn't it? I'd love to know what the context was for that, but all right. Uh, <laughs> all right uh, he, he, was, he was harping on about the fucking DMCA he tried to pull. Oh, okay. That's yeah. that was yeah. It, it, the the cut kind of threw me off there for a moment. Yeah. All right. I mean, <laughs> I guess that's it for now. Yeah, we'll we'll save the Dave thing for another time. Yeah, yeah. Let's let's save the Dave for another time. Yeah, know? save and shave the Dave. Eh? Oh God, he. <laughs> He looks like he just went through like two years on a deserted island and somehow came out worse. I was about to say menopause, but I guess that works. No, well. <laughs> manopause. <laughs> manopause. Manopause. Uh, man, well, Vaughn's always talking about the manosphere. I suppose that uh, maybe he and uh, <laughs> maybe he and Dave can collaborate on that. Mm. Uh, actually, I forgot. Dave actually hates Vaughn. What you remember that right? Like Brett Keen. Whatever happened to Brett Keen? I hate when he does voices, honestly. Uh, yeah, I hate when he fucking sings, because there's some shit that he's sung that... Dave, you should have just kept it a fucking internal thought. Have you ever heard him sing the rape song? Yeah, yeah, I have. Yeah. <laughs> I don't he, think we did play he that did. on here. No, 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 <laughs> no, we're not chancing that, no. Basically, he goes diddle, 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 diddly, diddle, diddle, diddle. Yeah, that's basically what he fucking does. It's an entire. It it, it is what it sounds like. Yeah. Uh, it, Dave it's... released an entire song about diddling. Yeah. <laughs> Diddler Dave. Diddling by the Dave. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys for watching. It wasn't a whole fucking ton of people here, but it's early in the morning, so of yeah, course it, it's it it's, it's seven thirty in the morning. Yeah. Damn. Thank you for, for those of you who did watch, chilled out with us, and offered your fucking feedback. You know, these streams would not be the same without the beautiful people in the chat. So thank you guys for watching. Drop a like if you like this shit. And, um, yeah, there's going to be shit coming up this week. I should uh, have a new video coming out for Heon on Tuesday on, on the CSB channel, so stay tuned yeah. for that. And um, I don't know what you're going to call that. What are you going to start? What are you going to call your, like, uh, videos? Um, I assume you're going to call it something else than Central State Broadcast. Special right? reports. Yeah, CSB special report or something like that. Yeah. yeah. I get you. That sounds good. That sounds good. All right. Yeah. So keep an, keep your eyes peeled for that. We should have more soon. I'm sure Mango will be going over that Jason oh. the video lady. Oh yeah. And um, even though you guys have already seen it, it'll be what it'll be worth seeing her watch it because I actually I want to see everybody's reaction to that. <laughs> I, I I'm gonna be entirely honest. That shit's been fucking awesome. Um yeah, oh, Jesus Christ. So thank you guys very much for chilling with me. Have a good fucking um have a good morning and thank you guys again for all the birthday wishes you gave me yesterday. I really did appreciate that. Um you guys are just absolutely fucking lovely. But yeah, I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to leave it there. Drop a like if you like this shit and as always guys, stay fucking toasty. Have a good fucking day. Good day. That's all you're going to say. So come on, say something more riveting. Penis <laughs> <laughs>